Good morning. It's Saturday. We just picked up, Jamie got some Starbucks. I picked up a rain. Uh, we got stuff for breakfast. We're having some Ezekiel bread toast, MBN. Uh, some just egg. And it was going to be avocado toast, but they didn't have ripe avocados ticking me off. And um, so I got some guacamole. It looks pretty good. You can go ahead, ahead and start. Oh, sorry. I'm sorry. No, that's okay. And uh, I'm going to cook up some eggs. We'll see how it turns out. I think I prefer vegan egg just a little bit. Like this is pretty much like all this can do is scrambled, I've found. It just like, it just sticks a lot, like more than it should. I like the taste of this better though. This tastes yeah, like a scrambled egg. Maybe. It has its uses. Okay, here you go. So Ezekiel bread toast, some guacamole only because they didn't have avocado, but it was some fresh looking decent guacamole. There's the just egg, some everything but the bagel seasoning. That's Jamie's over there. I just put this together. Mine I fried a little bit harder. I don't mind the little crispies and stuff. I guess I'll throw some Everything but the bagel on there. Maybe some ketchup if I feel like it. Don't hate. And uh, it's pretty good. I had a little sample again of the egg. Not that I haven't had just egg before, but you know, just been a little bit and I don't know. Good. Jamie and I are going to a drive-in movie tonight. Uh, assuming that uh, we can get there nice and early. You're, you're being a pessimist. True, I'm sorry. Uh, and we're gonna Should see... We now? now? we got time. We're gonna see Adam's Family. It's a double feature, because that's how they do uh, drive-ins. It's a nice classic style. Adam's Family and Abominable. What is that, Pixar, DreamWorks? Something. Something like that. I think it must be Pixar, right? Um, we just picked up a bunch of snacks. We're gonna probably get some Chinese food to bring to the place. Shh. You're not supposed to bring in stuff, but we're vegan, so I think we get a pass. Uh, there's limited things that you can buy there. Um, and that's that's the day so far. Chill, we chillin'. Heck yeah. And Jamie got her nails done. Very nice, pumpkin spice. Okay, we're setting up our station here for our drive-in movie. Uh, none of us are, have any sports affiliations, I just wanna get that clear. Don't come for me about anything, it's just a blanket. True. So this is looking pretty cozy. Okay, we made, I'm, I'm holding it so low because uh, we're in line, because the movie doesn't start for a while and it would just be weird if I start filming myself and talking and just we're stuck next to these people for like an hour. <laughs> but uh, yeah, we're like an hour and a half early, which is more earlier than more early than we wanted to be. But there's like 20 cars in front of us. It's kind of nuts. Yeah. But, uh, you know, hey. It is what it is. That's my favorite line now. It is what it is. Yeah. I keep saying it, but not even in like the right way. Yeah. True. It is what it is. It is what it is, yeah. though. Oh my God, is that going to be the new must be nice? Could be. Oh my god. Merch. <laughs> <laughs> it is what it is. Okay, I know you can't Don't see. Light on? No, it's okay. Oh, thank you. Uh, I can't talk for long because we got the music playing because this is the station they're gonna play the the sound on for the movie. Uh, I don't want to get copyright claimed here. But uh we're all we're all set up and cozy. We got our snacks, we got Chinese food, we're ready to go. Do we have some orange chicken? No, it's not it's sesame. I'm just kidding. It's it's sesame chicken. They don't have orange chicken, vegan orange chicken at this place, which is fine. But uh, I just thought it was a funny meme. Clickbait. Come at me. Hello. It's the next day. Uh, I know I didn't really wrap anything up from yesterday. By the way, I think I said it, but just to to reiterate, we went to go see. Adam's Family and Abominable last night. I'll explain more about that later. But uh, anyway, we just picked up some Starbucks. I just made Jamie some avocado toast and egg, some tomato, some, some lightly roasted cherry tomato. Thank you. She put some uh, everything but the bagel seasoning on it. 
I'm gonna have some leftover Chinese food come at me, and uh, we'll we'll uh, we'll we'll discuss the driving times in a little bit. Okay, so delicious breakfast at 12:30 p.m. So <clears throat> last night we were obviously at the drive-in movie. Uh, we ended up not staying for Abominable. Um, Cause it was just like, eh, it was just like tired and it took like over half an hour for it to come on after the last movie, which is weird because it said the the last movie ended like uh, Adam's family ended at nine thirty, and um, it was nine thirty was when the next one was supposed to come on. It said online, but then it didn't end up coming on until like after ten. And we were like already like driving out by that point. So we got our spot nice and early. We got to that line and stuff. They let us in. We got a nice spot. We set everything up. Our cozy little nook in the back with our snacks and our dinner. And we're eating and stuff. You're going to have to help me remember some of this stuff. Um, so everything was fine. We we're all settled in just waiting for the movie to start. We we're there again very early. And um, so like it started filling up. It, like obviously we were there an hour and a half early, and there was like, already like twenty people in front of us. I guess Saturday, big movie night. Uh, Adam's family's new. Well, it wasn't actually on the main screen. The, the main screen was Joker. I told you you argued with me all night that it wasn't gonna be that it was gonna be on the main screen. I kept saying no, but Joker's gonna be on the main screen. Adam's family's gonna be on the smaller screen. You're like no, it's not. No, it's not. And we'll guess where it was. True, it's a big movie, The Joker, I must admit. I thought maybe because Adam's family's brand new this weekend. No! <clears throat> but I, I think we also overestimated Adam's family a little bit for what it was going to be. But uh, So we were on like the second big. There's three screens. We were on the second biggest one, and then on the smallest one they had like Gemini Man and something else. Not interesting for me. Um, so anyway... It's the place is filling up. Like people are starting like drive around, like looking for spots, and like seem to be like like giving up almost. I don't know if they like oversell tickets or if people really have like a hard time squeezing in or something. So at the place, there's these like like poles sticking out of the ground in between the spots, kind of I guess like to designate the spots or whatever, and like some of them are far enough apart that you can squeeze two cars, two smaller cars. I, I, you could, I, I, I assumed that it was like, they put them there so you could put one car there and have enough room, you know, especially if you really want to like, like, you know, park their car and like, or like people like hang out the back of their car, like sit in the trunk or something, you know, just have like a little extra room to do stuff, open your doors, whatever you need to do. Um, some, some cars were parked two per thing, which I guess is possible in some of them, unless you have like a bigger car or something. Um. <clears throat> so we were like the movie was like just about to start we were laying back there and um someone pulls like like pe one of the people looking around like driving around for a spot like pulls in between us and like another car like like we're in one spot with the rails on either side the car next to us is like on the other side of of that rail and they they have a rail next to them like a little pole thing Someone, like, pulls between us. Like, there's a pole there, so they just kind of, like, like, stop halfway. They get out of the car, go to the person next to us, like, like walk up to their car. And it's, like, dark at this point. Like, movie's gonna start soon. <clears throat> and, like, I guess, like, ask them to move. Would, would you agree that's probably what? what they were doing? Oh, yeah. They, like, tapped on their window. Yeah, and the per person was like, oh, like, like, we didn't, couldn't hear them. You could tell she them. was a little ticked off. I would be really? too. Yeah. Um, Did you also mention the fact that it's like the movie was like starting already? Yeah, it was like, it was like, at that point it was like about to yeah. start. It was like just about that time. Like it was already dark, but the sun had gone down and everything. But I think they had like started playing games like when they like, paused. Really? Oh yeah, they were, they were like setting it up, like yeah. calibrating or whatever. Um, so it's not like so, it was like an hour before, like, not an hour, like, even, yeah. even like 15 minutes before the movie, like. It was, like, while it was about to start. So, like, at that point, we were like, oh, God, is someone going to ask us to, like, move over? Like, we're, like, literally, like, like everything set up, like, the, the radio tuned. We're laying down in the in the trunk with the seats down, like, um, like blankets over yeah. us and everything, like, eating dinner. And we're like, oh, God, is someone going to, like, ask us to move? And I was, like, firmly planted in my head, like, okay, I'm not going to do that, like, I don't know if it was the intention for two people to fit in these spots or not. It would have been very tight because the people who did 
choose to squeeze in two cars. It was very, like, you couldn't open the door, yeah. pretty much. Um, which doesn't really seem like a very comfortable drive and movie experience to me, yeah. but I don't know, maybe that's what they... But whatever. So I was like, okay, no, we've been here for like an hour and a half, like, and whatever. Like, other people can move or something. And so we were just like, like, laying there, chilling. Like, and the and we kept seeing like the headlights going. I was like, the person was like trying to like squeeze in or whatever. Um, and then I didn't, I didn't, I was just like laying there. You kind of saw this next part. Can you yeah. explain? A woman, I think that was with the car that asked other people to move, like walked around our car to see if there was space like in, like on the other side of us and then she looked in the back where we were I'm pretty sure and then she all and then she started like tapping on the the car which i i mean i can't i didn't want to make eye contact with her because i didn't want like to like her to be like oh like whatever yeah. but i'm 99 percent sure she definitely looked in and i'm 99 percent sure she tapped on our window too okay yeah i was i was like laying i was like literally laying there like <clears throat> not paying attention jane to to mansplain a bit must be nice Sorry, I wasn't clear enough. No, you were. You were. No, I'm, I'm saying my perspective, though. Um, so, I didn't... I she, she said, like, someone's, like, looking in or whatever. And then I heard a tap. I It was so light, I could have sworn it was the car next to us. Jamie's pretty sure it was it was to our car. Which is, like, like when is it ever appropriate to tap on someone's car, yeah. honestly? Ever. Like, yeah, like, it's just not needed. Like, if, like, if you can't get someone's attention, then, like, what, like, you know, it clearly wasn't anything that important if she didn't come, like, waving her arms in front of the window or anything. Um, so, like, we don't, like, you, you think that that person was, like, the wife of the other oh, guy yeah. or something? I don't know. Because um, she, like, walked around our car to see if there was room. Yeah. So... And then, like, they, the people that, like, were parked there over to the side, I guess they, they got that woman to move and they squeezed in next to her finally. Yeah. They started, like, pacing around their car. Like, the guy, yeah. they had, like, tons of chairs. and I guess it was, like, a whole family yeah. or something. They had tons of chairs. They decided to just, like, prop up in front of their car yeah, and between... Like yeah, like, to put a bunch of chairs to... They'd rather watch the movie outside, I guess. I don't know why which is that, insane but... to me that you'd want to watch a movie among, like, bugs and stuff, but... <laughs> To each, dark, to yeah. each their own. And, um... So they're, like, fussing. The, the movie's starting. Like, the movie oh, has... Yeah, yeah, it has started. They're, like, fussing about... The guy is, like... He's, like, shining a flashlight around, like, walking in front of our car, like, like, like pacing past the screen. Back yeah, pacing forth. back and forth. Like, opening his door, getting in the car, getting out of the car, getting stuff out of the car, waiting for people, looking for he's people. Like something at one yeah. point. Yeah. Like making us very uncomfortable because yeah. like it's if you can imagine being in a theater and watching a movie and someone's like getting up and shifting around and walking, walking in front of you, forth, yeah. yeah. Um, and like so we're like, oh god, like does it does he like is he gonna like ask us to move or something? Like yeah. is, are, are, I thought what I thought is maybe they um maybe they like looked in didn't see us because we were like laying in the back and assumed we were like in the bathroom or something and he was like looking around waiting for us to come back so he could ask us to move the car yeah which is like weird because they already parked yeah so i don't know what the deal is but they were like setting up basically like half in front of their car and half in front of ours yeah. Which like we couldn't see them from yeah, like whatever. like laying there, but then they when they kept standing up and like squeezing between the cars and stuff. And, like, the guy like changing his shirt. Yeah, the they're, yeah, they're just standing up, pacing around, weird stuff. Um, and at one point, he just turned on the flashlight of his phone and like shined it into our car yeah, and for like it in. like three seconds. Yeah, and like I didn't like get up because I was like, okay, like I you know people sometimes turn it on and go like turn. Or something, no, and not definitely yeah, in. definitely did it to look in for a second. Like I don't know, see if anyone was in there or not to ask us to move. But I don't know if he didn't see us. Yeah, maybe he didn't see us. Or what? Kind of down low. Yeah. Um, so like, that was, and it just made us very uncomfortable. It just made the first part of the movie very uncomfortable. But I didn't like. I just really didn't feel like just just getting up and like asking him what the hell is going on yeah. because that just would like started something like if you'd ask us to move which i was definitely not going to move once the movie started i'll tell you that much it, yeah all I, this wouldn't have been that big of a deal if it was like well before the movie yeah. started like if he came early and like whatever yeah. like he really wanted to like right. whatever it is what it i is. wouldn't have moved 
Either I way. Know, what if, like, if, if, if he came at a reasonable time and it was all filled up, there's no spots, and he just needed us to move over for whatever reason, that's fine. But when the movie's on, yeah. and then to be sketchy the entire yeah, time. Yeah, and they were, like, late, too. They were, yeah, like, pull, they were yeah. like pulling in at the time the movie was starting, exactly. pretty much. Um, and we'd been there for, like, an hour and a half, yeah. and it clearly had not been a problem up to And there were also other like cars the... that, were, like, only took up one. Yeah, like, yeah. That... We were certainly not the only ones that, that took up the whole spot. Uh, cause I really feel like that was the intention of the place, but I don't know. I feel like if I was to ask them, they would just say like, oh, if you could fit two, then fit two. Yeah. But, uh, <laughs> uh, so yeah, that was just like weird. And then, um, oh, thank, this, this was the best moment. Yeah. Um, you know when you're just really wishing, um, misfortune upon someone <laughs> that has wronged you, uh, so for horrible reasons? They like, I don't know if they like had like, like, adjusted something with their car like turn off turn back on or something i don't think it was the entire time but at one point they had like the parking lights on you know how there's like especially like modern cars how they have like the led strip that like goes around the headlights kind of that is turned on like the daylights the the day headlights kind of uh-huh. whatever you call it where it's not the actual headlights but it's just like a little strip of leds or something that lights up they had that on for, and I like, kind of noticed, but I also didn't want to get up, you know. We were also this was middle to of the movie, like 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 climax of the movie. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> and I could just kind of tell, like their like lights. It wasn't bothering us because we were next to them, but th- thank thank heavens, someone came and asked them like, "Hey, can you turn your lights off?" Yeah. Which was hilarious. Like the people in front of them were obviously like getting blinded by their yeah. lights being on, and we're trying to watch a movie. So that was hilarious. And then we just like kind of like saw them like scrambling in their car trying to figure out how to like keep the car on but have the lights turned off. It was like a weird thing. For our car, um you have to turn the car off, then put the parking brake on, then turn it back on, and that's how you get those those daylights off, which is weird. It's just, I guess specifically for like drive-ins and stuff. Um so that was we liked that they got yelled at. So anyway, we saw the movie. Um, it was it was fine. It was cute. <clears throat> Do you have an opinion? It, I agree with you. I think it was more. It felt more like a TV show, like the plot. Yeah, like, it, like an episode of a TV show. Yeah, it could have. It could have. It could have been like. I mean, I'm sure they wish it would become a TV show. That that's what all 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 movies probably all kids movies hope for. All those three D ones. I don't know. I'm just making that up. I hope, um, I hope. So it was fine. It was cute. It wasn't anything like I was. I was expecting something like epic. I don't know why, but um, I don't know. But so that ended, and we decided. I d- I made the commitment. Like, okay, we'll watch Abominable another time. We'll go see it in the theater or something, because we just were just like kind of done. It took w- too long for the movie to start. We wanted to just chill, relax, maybe watch some YouTube in bed or something. And, um, so then we were like, okay, we'll get, we'll leave. It was right before the next movie about to start. Um, and so we like got out of the car and they were, they were like the other people that were annoying us the entire time. They were like in their car or off like getting snacks or whatever, doing, doing whatever. There, some of them were in the car. I think I didn't, I didn't look, I wasn't, I wasn't inspecting. I did, still didn't want a reason to actually interact with them. Uh, <laughs> and, um, so I got out of the car to like, Open the, uh, I got out of the side door, squeezed out of it to open the trunk for Jamie to get out. And I was like walking around, grabbing stuff, like securing things that were going to move around while we were driving or whatever. And, uh, so like the, the people next to us, they like took their, their folding chairs and stuff. They were like, it would, it would, it, they put them like in between our two cars, basically like around that pole and stuff. They literally must have been like resting on the side of our car watching the movie because the chairs were like were like almost up against our car and so it's just like weird like i don't know why they're like fussing so much about this whole thing but yeah it was just a little distracting at the beginning it wasn't enough to like go say something but i was very ready to um be snippy af if if they actually tried to come over and get me to move Especially, like, after the movie started when we're, like, laying in the back, like, blankets on and stuff. But, anyway, so that was interesting. Just just wanted to complain about that a little bit. Just, it's just, it's, it's just entertaining <laughs> to me in some ways. Just people just being so annoying like that. But, um, 
I suppose that'll that'll go ahead and wrap up this vlog slash story time about a drive-in movie where people ticked me off. Um, and so it's Sunday, we're chilling, and we're just gonna enjoy the weekend. So I hope you all are having a great day. Isn't it like Columbus Day or something tomorrow? Y'all have off or nah? I never had the luxury of having off those holidays and stuff. Anyway, have a good one, Willow Davis out.